when I see something on the news or when I see something happening around me, I take it into my own hands to try and help them as much as possible. When people say that you, you take it into your own hands, like uh, many would say, oh, I go outside and protest or I call my lawmakers, but you hack, right? Yeah, I mean, let's say you're just browsing Reddit and you see something that people are freaking out over about some businesses' practices. We're trying to get in and then find information that could be used against them and then turn that around. Can you give me some examples? Yeah. Um, on Reddit a few years ago, there's this company, they put away the gay camps. There's a lot of testimonies about the counselors there who were beating the people, physically harming them, emotionally harming them. Well, you can go ahead and try and protest against it, do this and that, but they're still going to do what they're doing. So instead, you go ahead and you find out how to gain access into their networks. You find out emails, you find out groups. What'd you do with it? We, we uh, leaked the documents online. Um, they are available. Um, this, the company itself is really no longer. What is that feeling like when you have access to something as a hacker that you shouldn't have access to? Uh, the first couple of times, it's very adrenaline filled. The first time, way back when, you were, you were getting into front of computers and, you know, pranking them and making jokes on them and just feeling kind of godlike controlling the computer. Um, and eventually, if you start doing company and you start doing servers, there's much more of a thrill. Uh, much more adrenaline because now you know there's there's something that you have that could potentially be very dangerous both to you and to them. Nowadays, you know, it's like yes, you did it, and then that's really where the work truly starts. Because getting in, getting through the perimeter is just half the battle. Being able to plant malware that won't be caught, um, that'll go under the radar of any kind of security product that they have. You know, that's where kind of the real game starts. How many? companies would you say are you sitting in right now? Oh, I mean, I don't know, probably past tens of thousands. Breaking into a company, uh, even, if you, if you, even if you disagree with what they're doing or what they stand for, you can be put away for a long time. Are you, are you ever afraid or, or paranoid that, that that could happen to you? I mean, absolutely. Um, you know, eventually something might happen. Eventually, you know, everyone will have to pay for what they've done. But while you're doing it, you know you're helping people. I don't really think it's, it's good to worry about that.